Today we will learn about black holes. The conception of the black hole was proposed by two scientists, John Mitchell and Pierre Simon Laplace in the 18th century. In the year of 1967, a physicist named John Archibald Wheeler came up with the term black hole. Let's start with the introduction part. Black holes are one of the most powerful and mysterious forces in the universe. A black hole is where gravity has become so powerful that nothing around it can escape, not even light. The mass of a black hole is very much dense or compact, that the force of gravity is too much strong for even light to escape. I know you must be planning to see a black hole. Actually, we cannot see black holes because they don't reflect any light. Scientists know they exist by observing the light and objects around it. No problem. We cannot see them, but we can learn how they are formed. Black holes are made when very big stars explode at the end of their life cycle. This explosion is known as a supernova. If a star has enough mass, then it will collapse on itself down to a tiny size. Due to a small size and enormous mass, the gravity will be so strong it will absorb light and become a black hole. Black holes can grow incredibly large as they continue to absorb light and mass around them. They can absorb other stars too. I hope the topic of black holes is no longer a mystery for you. Now it's time to note down some facts about black holes. Black holes can have the mass of several million suns. Black holes do not live forever. Black holes differ from each other in mass and their spin style. Feel free to share this video with your friends and don't forget to help others. Stay tuned for more videos. <laughs>